Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. I'm going to discuss with you my scientific presentation on the topic metabolism, sensitivity, and reproduction. First, we will talk about metabolism. As the body and organs are the constituents of different chemicals, they perform various metabolic functions that results in the conversion of chemicals into other biomolecules. All plants and animals and microbes exhibit metabolism. It is absent in the case of non-living organisms but may be introduced through the in vitro method. Second, sensitivity. The living organisms where the prokaryotes respond according to their surroundings and the stimuli present around them. It may be physical, chemical or biological. The living organisms are sensitive about their surroundings and are responsible in their accordance stimuli. The stimuli can either be biological, physical or chemical. Third, reproduction. The ability to produce young ones is the process of reproduction, which is observed only in the case of living organisms. In the case of fungi, reproduction occurs through a sexual spores, while in the case of hydra, budding occurs, and in the case of planaria, regeneration occurs which are all the sexual method, methods of reproduction. Reproduction means increase in the number of cells. As Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the glorious Quran, in Surah Zumar, chapter number 39, verse number 7, He created you all from a single soul, then from it He made its mate, and He produced for you four pairs of cattle. He creates you in the wombs of your mothers, in stages, one development after another in three layers of darkness that Allah your Lord all authority belongs to him there is no God worthy to worship except him how can you then be turned away assalamu alaikum